Jolly old Saint Nick made me wait all year for the D. Twelve months of Christmas screaming ho ho ho. Slide down my chimney sucking on my Mr. Toe. My fresh chocolate chip cookies sitting. What's up, Danny gang? So today we are about to go to Michael's because I need to look and see if they have a gingerbread house because for one of my videos this month, I want to make a gingerbread house with y'all and kind of just talk and gossip. So I am actually looking for a gingerbread house. I'm bringing y'all along. So yeah, today I'm just rocking this olive green shirt with this black cardigan, my black purse, some jeans and hirachis. Can you see them? And my olive green hirachis like i love hirachis y'all this is that this is it. hirachis are my favorite shoe period as soon as i came in y'all i see the gingerbread houses so they have this one the gingerbread house like the elf on a the shelf they have this one they have the my little pony one the super mario kart one this one's ten dollars i'll probably go with this one because i don't know if i'm gonna do that oh. oh let's look on the other side oh the eight dollars Oh, but I don't want this one. All Wilton gingerbread quick kits. Nice. I'm not doing like too much decorations this year. But if I was, I think I would want to do this color right here and pair it with a couple of those glittery ones and then pair it with maybe white or clear. Maybe those. That would be my color scheme. So while I'm in Michael's, y'all, I'm trying to get like some more festive things for my videos. So I do see they have like a lot of Christmas socks here. And I think that this is so cute right there. Um, they have like a lot of Christmas themes like headbands and stuff. I'm trying to like plan out all my videos so I know what to buy. They have like Santa hats and elf hats, which is pretty dope. So far, I just have the gingerbread house because that's the video I'm going to do. But they do have ugly Christmas sweaters for 18 and like I said, I don't need an ugly Christmas sweater because my friends are throwing a pajama jam. So I don't need an ugly Christmas sweater. Not this year, at least. This Michaels is pretty nice, but I think all I need is the gingerbread house. So let's get it and then go to Dollar Tree. This one has caught my eye. It's so pretty. If you think my hands are full, you should see my heart. That is so cute. Oh my God. I need a planner, but I'm just gonna get the gingerbread house today. Okay guys, so we back. Y'all, I just did the quickest run um, in Michaels. That was so quick, but I was watching my sis, K Love TV. Y'all, go watch K. She is like super consistent, and I like her vlog. She's she does she has a vlog channel, but she mixes content videos in. She's dope. If y'all haven't noticed, I love my friends. They're all dope. I try to shout them out. But yeah, she has a vlog channel and she's doing vlogmas as well. So I'm gonna leave her link down below so you guys can go check out K. But she um stop honey she built a gingerbread house on her channel for vlogmas but it was an epic fail so she inspired me to do the same thing k just encouraged me and pushed me over the ledge to go ahead and do it so y'all saw me get the gingerbread house and they're all on sale so if y'all got kids and want to have like a fun event like for christmas break or you know just something fun to do 
um michael's has the gingerbread houses on sale for eight dollars like the whitman's brand they're all on sale for eight dollars it doesn't matter which one you get come on y'all it doesn't matter which one you get so i thought that that was a really good deal i kind of wanted to talk so i work in the corporate world and i have natural hair obviously so yesterday you guys remember i had a big puff in my head today i did a bantu knot out so now i have my bantu knots a bantu knot twist out I just have a question. Do y'all experience with all my natural hair and African American um, ladies that watch me? Do y'all experience what I experience in the workplace? If I change my hair or if I do something slightly different, it's like, oh my God, like Danny, like, oh my God, like, what did you do to your hair? Is that your hair? Now, typically, I don't get offended by the is that your hair questions. Um, I just don't I know society is just like off the chain so I don't typically get offended by those questions but do y'all and do y'all get offended when people ask like why do you change your hair so much or you know I'm I'm sorry I have natural hair I love having natural hair even though I want to get dreads but I love having natural hair and I think natural hair is so versatile because like I said it's in a bantu not out today um, yesterday I was in a high pub sometime it's in a turban us as natural hair African American women, we can do so much with our hair, and um, people of other ethnicities, they pretty much wear their hair the same every single freaking day, which kills me personally. Sometimes I want to say, why y'all hair the same every single day? Um, but let me know in the comments, wh where do you guys work, and do you experience any type of questions or anything pertaining to when you wear your natural hair, when you have braids or weave? Um, does anyone say anything like about having so many different hairstyles i just want to know because i think it's quite freaking funny that i'm always asked like about my hair or if i put a turban on how do you tie that um knowing they can't can't do it um because their hair is so silky it'll just fall off but i always wanted to know like is it just in the corporate world or and it's the crazy thing is i work with almost all african american african americans but the ones i don't work the ones that aren't they always have questions so let me know down below okay guys so i'm back from dollar tree i was gonna vlog when i was in there but it was lit like a big so i didn't even vlog hi welcome to my taco my name is luna what can you make for today um can i please just have a cinnamon churro. Just a, one? Yep, just a regular one. I'm sorry? Yep, just a regular okay. cinnamon churro. Anything else? That's it. 106 at the window. Thank you. Thank you. Y'all, so I already ate my lunch, but since I had to come out, I decided to stop and get a churro. Y'all, I don't know if y'all have a Del Taco around you, but Del Taco is pretty much, I think I've talked about Del Taco on my channel before, but it's pretty much like um, an Americanized, well, Taco Bell is American, but i think but it's kind of like a taco bell but they offer other types of food like hamburgers and stuff like that and the sides are really weird because you can get like a burrito and fries or a taco and fries just weird shit but they have these churros that are a dollar and i get one every now and then just to curve my sweet tooth y'all it's worth every bite one dollar hi one mm -hmm. thank you you're welcome But yeah, these churros off the chain. So if you got a Del Taco in your area, hit them up. Thank you. So if you have a Del Taco in your area, hit them up. They are bomb. They also got like some donuts and some like cheesecake bites and stuff. But I just stick with the regular churro off of the chain. I will show it to y'all when I get to my office, like when I park. But anyway, how y'all doing today? Y'all doing okay? Today's day seven of Vlogmas, so it's going by pretty quick. It is day seven of Vlogmas. Um, I really need y'all help though. Can y'all leave some um, video ideas down below? And also, oh yeah, this is another thing. 
I want to do a QA, and a like an in-depth, all the dirty, um, crazy questions y'all got. I want to do a Q&A with no strings attached. So if y'all have questions, can you please leave them down below? Any type of questions, doesn't matter what it pertains to, I'll answer it, I think. I know some things y'all want to know. And although I do YouTube and I'm a content creator, excuse me, I don't do a lot of vlogging. So a lot of you guys might not know everything about me and you might want to know some questions. So yeah. But this is the churro from Del Taco and it's basically fried bread dipped in cinnamon sugar. Y'all, bomb. So $1, you get this long churro. And like I said, it's basically fried bread dipped in cinnamon. And I love Del Taco because they're always fresh. One second. Lord, thank you for this food that I'm about to receive. Thank you for the people that prepared it. And thank you for nourishing my body. Amen. So, yeah. <laughs> I'm just playing with y'all. But I do have an ASMR channel, so look in the description box below. Because I do have an ASMR channel, if you're into that. Then she gonna say just one. You know I wanted two. You know I did it. My subscribers are climbing, climbing, climbing. Thank y'all. But I have a lot of silent viewers. So please let me know down below what y'all want to see. Shout out to all my new subscribers. Thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. 6K by the new year. Can we do it? Can we do it? Let me know. Happy Friday. Today, a new episode of the Ted and Ty Show goes up. We are talking about breastfeeding, and we're getting... We have a guest on the show. She's going to be talking about breastfeeding because she's also a doula. And Ted and Ty will be giving a man's point of view to breastfeeding. And, of course, I'll be giving my point of view to breastfeeding in public. So click the link down below. Check out the Ted and Ty show featuring Danny J. It's a podcast that I'm on. I've been on it for the last month, a little more than a month. And I'm having a really good time doing it. We talk about music. And it's just a podcast for the urban intellect. So go ahead, click the link down below. And check us out, subscribe, leave a review, rate the show. We appreciate it. Anyway, guys, I'm headed back into the office. If you made it all the way to the end of the video, go ahead and drop that loaf of bread because I just finished eating churros. So go ahead and drop that loaf of bread down below. I'm going to leave it on the screen so you'll know which one I'm talking about. And I'll see you guys in my next video, which will be tomorrow. Reporting live from the internet, signing out. Back to you, world. Deuces.